Facing the country's flag, these protesters performed Eid El Adha prayers on the streets of Khartoum, where marches against army rule have been held for months. An imam borrowed the microphone, usually used to chant protest slogans, to deliver his sermon. People in Sudan worked Eid amid worsening economic hardship, with high inflation and currency shortages continuing to upset the country's already fragile economy. After the prayers, chants against the army rang out again. Junta leader Abdel Fattah al-Burhan last week offered to put in place a civilian government nearly a year after overthrowing the sovereign council. But the protest movement has rejected the army's offer, calling instead for Burhan to resign. In Kenya, hundreds of Muslims marked the first day of Eid El Adha with prayers at the Masjid Rahma Mosque in Nairobi on Saturday. The four-day celebration, which involves the ritual slaughtering of animals, is also known as the Feast of Sacrifice. The importance of this day, other than the Eid, is we sacrifice, and the blood that is poured is a form of sacrifice that reaches Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, God Almighty, and not the flesh, and not other than that from the meat. Once you spill the blood, you get the blessings from Allah Almighty. Eid El Adha was celebrated around the world on Saturday.